Hey, what's up, everybody? This is Toasty Gamer Boutique. We're here playing Dragon City, and this is the new heroic race. We've got 10 days and 18 hours to get to at least lap five to qualify and hopefully get that first place spot. Here, the final prizes are we've got the beautiful High Queen Jodicea dragon. Absolutely epic. Heroic dragon. It looks amazing, and I definitely would like to get this dragon. Here, there's a couple other dragons. We've got the Nature Knight as well. Super beautiful. Here, we've got the Mars God Dragon, epic and fierce. And last but not least, the Holy Knight Dragon. Definitely a great lineup of dragons to add to our collection here. Well, let's get this started. First things first, we're going to have to get items by feeding our dragons. Here, we're going to have a bunch of laps, and these laps have node missions within them. So, so let's start feeding our dragons. Here, I'm going to go to my dragon book. I'm going to put in power, uh, in order by power ascending. This is going to give us all of the level one dragons here first. And I want to feed, well, the highest or the strongest, uh, the strongest level one dragon over here and get those beetles. You know what I mean. Anyways, here, we're going to go feed this low level dragon. It's not going to cost too much food. And hopefully we're going to see those beetles pretty soon here. Let's go. So I'm just going to keep feeding this dragon. I don't see any beetles yet. There we go. One. Okay, finally. Here we go. Two, three, and four. That's it. Beautiful. So here, I'm going to go back to the heroic race. Now we've got to get items by collecting gold. Okay, perfect. So we're looking for five of those ruby diamonds. Oh, yeah. Let's go. There's one, two, and three, four. Was that enough? I don't know if we got four or five. We got it. Okay, beautiful. So now we've got to get these dragon fruit by collecting food. Okay, perfect. So that's why you see I've got a little, uh, you know, I've got food, gold left over. I was waiting for this. When I saw it, I was like, oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this heroic race. Oh yeah. We just got five of those pomegranates. Next thing, we're have to get a, we're gonna have to get the items by feeding dragons. So back to the dragon book. Let's go. Here, we're going to go choose one of those lower level dragons again. I want to go with the strong level one dragons. So here, next one up in the mix, I'm not going to go with the level 10 dragon. That's going to cost 145 food. Here, we're going to go with the level one Hebe dragon, legendary. And we're going to feed this. We're looking for, what was it, five beetles? But beware, there might be cooldowns on this. Let's go check it out. Here, if we go back to this, we're at three out of six. Okay, so we're good. I believe for lap one, node four, we can get five of the beetles, and then we have a five minute cooldown. So, ba ba ba, let's go back to the dragon book, and we're looking for two more of the beetles. And just scrolling, here we go. So next, I'm gonna choose the Atlantis dragon, and we're gonna feed it a little bit more. We're looking for two more beetles. Oh, one out of two, two out of two, woo! Looking fabulous. So now, basically, we're gonna have to wait five minutes for that cooldown to pass. I'll be back. Awesome. We're back. I set some five minute food and it's almost over. That means it's time to feed our dragons once again. Here we're going to go back to the dragon book. We're going to put them in power, uh, order by power ascending. And we're just going to feed whichever dragon comes along here. Uh, ba, 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 ba. Looking for a legendary dragon, of course, though. Here, Atlantis. Okay, perfect. We're looking for one beetle. Oh, yeah. And we got that beetle. Let's get back to the heroic race and see what's up next. Awesome. Here, we've got to get those items from battles. So here, we're going to go battle the hedgehog dragon. And this is a perfect opportunity to rank up any dragon. I'm going to go with the High Kronos dragon from the previous heroic race. Let's go. Yas Queen. So here we're just looking to get that victory. Should be pretty relatively easy. I've got a really strong dragon. Oh yeah, there we go, baby. Woo! Victory. And now we got to go we have to go up against the angry dragon. So we've got a 15 minute countdown. Well, I guess I'll be back in about 15 minutes. And we're back, and we're about to go up against the angry dragon. Hopefully, we'll be able to get the victory for this encounter. Here, I'm going to go with the strong dragon again, the high chronos dragon here. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Hopefully, we're going to be able to pull off the victory. I've got a pretty good feeling. Here, we're going to use our strong move, Rust, and Putzang, baby. There we go. Victory. Oh, yeah. So here, we're making progress. Ooh, hello, 20 gems. I'll take that. We just completed lap one, and for reaching lap two, we've gotten 
20 gems. Ooh, love it. Oh, yeah. Perfect. Here, if we go to this menu here, we can check out the lap rewards. And we just got those 20 gems. If we can make it to lap three, then we're going to get the very rare egg chest. Definitely worth it. Yeah, let's keep this moving. So here, our next quest is going to be to get items by feeding your dragons. We need eight of those beetles. So here we're going to go back to the dragon book and put that in power order ascending. And we're just going to go to, uh, I think, the Atlantis dragon here. And let's get those eight beetles. We're at two right now. Three. And four. Five. Beautiful. So here I'm going to switch up dragons. We're going to go with the sarcophagus dragon. Here we're going to go for a couple more beetles. Was I at five? Oh man. Six. Seven. And we're looking for, did I already get it? Eight maybe? Okay. Well, I can't count, but I think we're doing great. Yeah, we need to get that eighth one there. Let's go back to the dragon book. Put them in that power order and a sarcophagus. Let's do this. Here, yeah, there it is. So there we got the eighth beetle looking fabulous. And we're going to go back over here. Check out where we are in the heroic race. Now we've got to get items by collecting food, six dragon fruit, and we have to get eight gems by collecting gold. Let's go. So here I saved myself a little bit of gold just in case. There we go. Four diamonds already. Things are looking pretty good. Okay, I have a great feeling about this here. I'm just going to get that gold real quick there and let's collect some food. Oh, yeah. So I, I think I have the 12 hour food in there here. We're just going to collect a little bit more and I think that should do it. Yes. Okay. Now we've got to win a league battle. This one can be pretty tricky. So I saved my uh, daily spin here. Here we got a free spin. This is an opportunity. I'm going to try to win the league battles, but if I can't win it, then we're going to go and use that free spin. Let's give it a try at least. League battles, come on universe, give me all the luck I need because I sure am going to need it. Let's go. League battles. These are tricky. They're not easy. And if you don't have a strong dragon, then they could be near impossible. But we've got a pretty good lineup. I'm going to start off with pure energy here. Come on, fingers crossed. Uh oh, not the strongest move. Okay, we're going to swap our dragons here. So here, we're going to go use the red dragon. It's got a red arrow for nuclear hit that flame move. Oh yeah, rock on. Perfect. Just what we needed. And then here. Okay, that dragon's pretty strong. Uh, I think I want to swap it up, but this is going to be the strongest dragon for sure. So nuclear hit, we're going to use that strong move there and we're doing good, but we just lost our first dragon. That's okay. Here next up, oh man, pressure's on. Okay, here next up, we're going to use the high chronos dragon. We're going to use pure energy. That's that dragon's strongest move and two dragons down, one to go. Okay, come on, let's do this universe. I've got a good feeling here. My lineup of dragons pretty strong. We still have one dragon and hopefully we're going to be able to pull off the victory. Come on. Don't destroy me in this hit. Okay. Yes, we got it. Leaf blast. And there you go, baby. Oh, yas queen victory here. I'm going to go and watch this ad to get that 8,000 food. So then we just got 8,000 food for watching that quick video there. And we got the win for the league battle. Let's see what's next on the menu here. We've got to get items by collecting food and we also have to get item from battle. So let's start off with the battle here. We're going to go with the Poseidon dragon here and hopefully we're going to get another victory here. I'm trying to rank up this dragon right now. It's got a B plus. So I'm going to keep using this dragon. Let's go. Come on, let's get that victory. Here, we're going to use our strongest move, pure energy, and it is definitely strong indeed. We're going to have to wait about 15 minutes for the next encounter. While we're waiting for that, let's go get items by collecting food. So here, we've got a little bit of food left over, and what I like to do is put in the 30-second food. I know it takes a little bit of time, but I find that this is the best strategy when you're trying to get those pomegranates. Now, I believe for this node of lap two, we're going to have a little bit of a cool down. So here I'm going to set a bunch of 30 second food and da, 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 30 seconds looking fabulous. Oh, yeah. And here let's go get that food. Oh, yeah, let's do this. So here I'm just using the 30 second food. It refreshes pretty quickly. You have less chances of getting a pomegranate, but this is better than waiting like 10 hours or what is it? 12 hours there. So we're just going to go with this and da, 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 30 second food. Beautiful. Keep it going here. We're going to go and uh, there we are. 30 second food. We're just going to refresh this 
fabulous and keep it going 30 second food again perfect here we've got a couple more to set let's do this so here 30 second food and da, 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 scroll in here 30 second food fabulous and this one hello i guess i had the one day food there so 24 hours here we're just gonna just gonna put the 30 second food and we're gonna start collecting that there we go we got our first pomegranate so this is looking pretty good here when it comes to lap two node four we're gonna have a 19 minute cool down once we get six out of seven so right now i have four out of seven we need two more pomegranates let's go oh we got one looking good yeah no pomegranate there. We're going to regrow all. Fabulous. And there's one that I don't have food growing from. Oh, I guess I did 11 hours there. Whoops. Anyways, in 12 hours, that's going to be ready. Perfect for getting food. Yes. And we just got the pomegranate. Beautiful. Here, I'm going to regrow all there. And we should have, yes, six out of seven. So... I'm going to be back in 19 minutes, A, for the food, because we have a 19 minute cooldown right now, and B, for the next battle. I'll see you in 19 minutes. Perfect. So here, at least 19 minutes has gone by, and here we're going to go for the next battle. Let's do this. Here, we're going to select the same dragon as before, the High Kronos dragon, and hopefully we're going to get ourselves another victory. Oh yeah, let's go. Here, we're going to use pure energy, and beautiful, just what we needed. Victory! Oh yeah. So here, we made a little bit of progress. Next up, we've got to get items by collecting food, and that should be relatively easy here. Come on, pomegranate, where you at? And yes, there we go. Perfect. So here we're moving on to the next uh, the next node. Here we're on lap two, node five. So here we've got to get items by feeding our dragons and get items by breeding dragons. Okay, we got this. So when it comes to feeding our dragons, there's a pull of eight. So we're going to be able to get eight beetles and then we're going to have to wait uh, 19 minutes each. So a total of 38 minutes for the next beetles. So here, let's go. We're going to start feeding our dragons. We're going directly to the dragon book and we're going to do the same thing we did earlier. Get one of those level one dragons and preferably like a legendary dragon. Oh, let's go with the boulder dragon. Oh, yeah. Beautiful. So there we've got two and where three. Yeah, there we go. Four, five, six seven eight yes awesome so there i believe we've got eight out of ten so for the next ones we're gonna have to wait for that cool down to finish let's go breed some dragons oh yeah here i've got a little bit of space here we're gonna go ahead hatch the engineer dragon beautiful and i'm gonna place that right there here we could go ahead and collect a little bit of food no biggie with that did I say food? I meant gold. Here, you know, our habitats, they're producing gold at a pretty good rate, so I'm not too worried about that. Collecting that gold. There we go. Yeah, beautiful. And then, next, breeding dragons. Okay, here, you know, typically, I'll do Terra and Terra breeds. So, I'm going to rebreed my Terra and Terra dragon. They're both level 5, so a low-level Terra, Terra dragon. But... I do have some dragons left over from previous breeding because I've been breeding other dragons. Here we've got the lucky dragon and another dragon. I can't see what it is and I don't remember. And then here we've got two dragons up there that are breeding. These ones won't be ready for an hour and 46 minutes. So here we're going to go hatch that Terra dragon. Oh yeah, looking good, beautiful. And well, back over here, I think we're going to hatch this egg as well. We've got the Vanargan dragon. Ooh, beautiful, from that maze that we had the other day. Definitely loving that dragon and super stoked to add it to my collection. Yes, beautiful. That's going to be a great dragon to feed as well. So here, let's go. That's a breed for sure. Oh, and we just got the Taj Mahal dragon from that breed. Here, I'm still trying to get that um, dragon. It was the, here, the Legacy dragon. So I'm still working on that. Here, I've got, you know, decent chances of getting it, but nothing's guaranteed. You know, you have to unlock these um, power exclusives that are available. So we've got a couple of those there. And hopefully, one of those days, we're going to get that dragon. Already, though, bad sign. We don't have the new symbol, so it's going to be a dragon we already have. But no biggie. It's good. And then here, when it comes to breeding, we're going to keep on breeding the Terra and Terra Dragon. Now, this can get a little bit repetitive, but it's my favorite technique for going through the you know, the tasks where you have to breed dragons. So thank you so much to the people that taught me that. Oh yeah, woo! 
here we go. Here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna hatch and keep breeding. I know this can be v very repetitive even, and uh, yeah, it takes a little bit of time, but it's better than waiting hours and hours for that breed. So here, we're just gonna keep that going and shouldn't be too long. Here, we've already got our Terra egg, that's ready. We can go ahead and place that. Now, if I really wanted to optimize the speed at which I'm breeding and hatching eggs, I would have all three of my breeding areas, the ultra breeding tree, the breeding mountain, and the breeding sanctuary over here, I would have them all breeding Terra and Terra. Since the heroic race has just begun, I'm not quite in that mode yet, but this should go pretty well here. Beautiful. So you get the gist of it. I'm going to be hatching Terra eggs, breeding Terra eggs, and the best thing is to recall those Terra dragons there. So here, if we go to the recall center, you know, it's great for if you want to empower your Terra dragons here. Perfect place. I'm going to either recall them here. Otherwise, if I get too many, I do sell them every now and then, the level one Terras, but the best thing is to recall them there to get those orbs. Let's see. Will we get this? Let's see. Come on. We want to see that olive branch. Let's go. Okay. Well, anyways, you get the gist of what I'm doing. I'm going to do this a bunch of times. There's no minimum on this breeding mission here, so we should get it eventually. The one thing we are going to have to work on is the feeding dragons. So that's going to be available in about 30 minutes from now. Here, we can go ahead and place that. And it was 38 minutes in total. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to I'm going to collect some food here, and I'm going to set myself the 30-minute food. So that way, I'll have a general idea of when I need to feed my dragons. Oh, yeah. And this video is going to continue. Here, I'm going to pause it again. I'm going to keep on breeding these dragons. I'm hoping we get the olive branch while I'm talking right now. But I have a bad feeling that I might take a little bit more time. So we'll be back in just a jiffy, maybe about 30 minutes or so, so that we can move on to the next node once we're done feeding those dragons and breeding these dragons here oh yeah thank you so much for watching this video make sure to hit that thumbs up button for the like and i'll see you in 30 minutes we're back it's been at least 35 minutes here breeding the terra and terra dragons we ended up getting that second olive branch and now hopefully the time has passed so we can get these two beetles let's go feed some dragons oh yeah here we're going to our dragon book and we're just going to choose one of those higher stronger dragons that are level one and da, 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 da. yeah there we go vanaguard here we go so we're looking for two beetles hopefully we're gonna see both of these beetles show up yes we got both of them rock on that means we're moving on to the next quest here Ooh, and we just reached lap three there we go here we're gonna get that very rare egg come on big money big money Woo! we just got no way the nature knight dragon no way that is too cool isn't that one of the rewards Nature Night Dragon, oh my Lantis. Okay, really epicness there, super cool. I'm stoked about that and actually surprised. Hey, let's keep this going. Now we've got to get the gems by collecting gold and we've got to get items by collecting food. Okay, we've got this. Here we're gonna go ahead, start collecting all of that food. And here I had that 30 minute food set, so I'm just gonna reset this to 30 seconds and let's get that food cooking in the oven. Oh yeah. Here, I believe there are no, no minimums, so we're just going to go and start collecting this gold. Let's do it. Yeah, looking good. Here, I don't have as much gold as I had earlier, so I'm going to turn on Meridian Tower, get that gold boost going on. And where is a little bit more gold? Yeah, there we go. We just got one of those red gems. Looking fabulous, darling. Oh, yeah. Here, we're still waiting on that food, so I'm going to come over here and let's see if we can get another red gem. You can get them from uh, collecting gold on habitats that aren't like maxed out on gold just yet. It's a little bit more difficult though. Yeah, there we go, we just got one, awesome. And back to the food, let's go. So here we're collecting that from our farms. We're gonna go ahead and grow all again and let's see where we're at. We've got seven out of 11, three out of eight. Okay, so we're doing good. We've got a little bit more progress to make. And here, down here, these habitats usually have a lot of gold. Yes, there we go, beautiful. So there, I believe, oh, we're just one away. We're so close. Okay, so here we almost have it. We're just gonna go for one more of those gems. Come on, big money, big money, let's do this. Yeah, there we go, and we got it, beautiful. So here, we're gonna go back and let's get this food grooving. Woo, hey, we just got three of the dragon fruits. Love it, 
Yes. So now we only need two more dragon fruits. Awesome. So I still have my daily spin. Things are going good. I finally made it into fourth place. So I'm starting to get a little bit of traction here. Now you need to reach at least lap five to qualify. So I want to reach lap five in the you know first couple days, hopefully maybe today, but I mean, I don't want to get my hopes up too soon. This is a marathon. It is not a sprint. So you got to think about it. It lasts 12 days. That's practically two weeks there. Steady, steady wins the race. Let's go. There, we just got one dragon fruit and I think we need one more. Okay. So patience is a virtue here. We're going to wait on that food and we're going to keep this going here for the next lap. Ooh, banner chest. Hello. Let's check this out here. Get two rewards from the following list. Ultimate sword, uh, ultimate sword fragments, Terra banner. Ooh, interesting. Or a gem. Hello, hello. I believe I saw these here when it comes to the events. Right now, we've got the Clash of Houses. I believe that is the air quotes event that's going on right now. And I thought I saw those here. That's where we're going to use the ultimate sword fragments and the banners. So those are going to come in handy. Yeah, let's keep this moving. Beautiful. So there, come on. Oh no, we didn't get a dragon fruit. What? Are you serious? Okay. So here, patience, patience, darling. I'm going to see if we can't get, yes, a dragon fruit from the greenhouse. That's what I'm talking about. Beautiful. Next up, oh my gosh, the dreaded league battles. So here, we have to win two league battles. Hopefully, we're going to be able to pull off the victor victory, but otherwise, I've got my daily spin in my pocket. Let's go. Come on, universe. Give me the force I need to get the victory here. This is a Titan Dragon, so it's going to block our first move. Ooh, very strong there. Oh, my goodness. Okay, so how are we going to do this? I'm nervous. Here, I'm going to use pure energy, but this move is going to be blocked anyways, and I think we're going to lose this dragon. Not the end of the world, but not good either. Here, next up, we're going to go ahead and use Leaf Blast. Yes! Okay, good move there. Don't destroy me. Okay, phew, we're still alive, but I have a bad feeling about this. These opponents are strong. No! And we just lost our dragon. Okay, here, we've got the red dragon, and we want to use our most powerful move, pure energy. Uh-oh. Oh, no. This is going to be a tough one. Come on, get us that victory. Okay, here we go. Hopefully this last dragon isn't too strong. Two down, one to go. Don't destroy me. No. Yes. Okay, yes. But we can watch a trailer. Okay, I'm going to pause this. I'll be right back. I'm going to watch that trailer. Awesome. So lucky for me, I was able to watch a trailer. And here we're going for it again. We revived our red dragon. Hopefully it's going to be strong enough. Don't destroy me, darling. Come on. I want to get that victory. Let's go for the heroic race. Putzang. And woo. We got our first victory. Oh, yeah. One down, two to go. Here, I'm going to go watch an ad for the uh, trailer for the food there. 8,000 food is definitely very good, and we're going to need all the food we can for this heroic race. Awesome. So there we just watched that trailer and we're back. We're going for another battle here and it's our last combat that we have for the next six hours. Fingers crossed. Oh, my gosh, I'm nervous. Hopefully we can pull off a victory. Oh no, not another Titan Dragon. So here the Titan Dragon, of course, is going to block our first move. I'm going to go with pure energy and hopefully it will be good once we get through that shield. So now we're actually able to attack this dragon. Yes, okay, it is strong. Phew, here we go. Pure energy, let's do this. Come on, woo, one down, two to go. Beautiful. Oh no, we just lost our dragon. Okay, so here I'm going to use the High Druid Dragon. That it has the Nature Move Leaf Blast, which has the red arrow indicating it's strong. And strong it is. Yes, here we go. So far we're off to a good start. Two down, one to go. Ooh, that dragon is strong. Oh my Lantis. Here I'm going to use the strongest move, Slash of Ages. And I think we're about to lose this dragon. Hopefully my next dragon is more... Um, resistant to this dragon come on pure energy let's go big move i'm nervous i'm nervous okay here at least that move wasn't too damaging for uh the hit that we took and yes we got the victory oh yeah looking good here definitely recommend watching that ad for the 8000 food be right back 
Awesome. So there we just got the 8,000 food and we can use all the food that we get here. Let's go. Let's see what the next node mission is here. Ooh, okay. So now we've got to get items by collecting food and we got to do some battles. So here we're going to go up against the mud dragon and same dragon. I'm going with the high chronos dragon. I want to rank it up. I want that A+. plus. Oh yeah. Here first move flooding. Not too shabby. We're going to use our move with the red arrow and patang. Woo! Great victory right there. Now we're going to have to wait 15 minutes for the dark fire dragon. And I think for this third battle, we're going to have to wait 30 minutes. So that's going to take a little bit of time. I'm going to keep using the high chronos dragon. So we'll be back for that. And in the meantime, I'm going to collect a little bit of food. Here we have a little bit of food ready. So not too shabby. That's going to give us a couple dragon fruit. And I'm just going to keep basically repeating this process here. Um, shouldn't be too long and you know we can collect that gold that's there we've got two dragon fruit so basically I'm just gonna keep growing the 30 second food keep on collecting that food and then we're gonna be back for these battles and we're back and we're going for the battle against the dark fire dragon let's do this hopefully we'll get a one-hit wonder let's go High Chronos Dragon, definitely an amazing dragon. This is the dragon that we got during the last heroic race, and it has been doing me some good. Woo! That's what I'm talking about. Victory! Oh, yeah. And just like I thought, we're going to have to wait 30 minutes for the next battle. I'll see you in 30 minutes. Rock on. So here, 30 minutes has gone by, and now it's time to battle against the Thor Dragon. Let's go. Here, you know it. I'm going to select that High Chronos Dragon, and let's do it. Yeah! Hopefully this goes as well as the last battles have gone. I have a pretty good feeling and yes, that's what I'm talking about. Victory. Oh yeah. So there we just completed node three of lap three. Now we're moving on to node four. Let's do this. So here we've got to get items by feeding dragons. We need 12 beetles and here we have to get items by collecting food and we need 10 of those. This node does have a cooldown. So here we're going to be able to get 9 out of 12 of the beetles and then for each extra beetle we're going to have to wait 10 minutes so a total of 30 minutes. When it comes to collecting food we're going to have a pool of 8 of those and then we're going to have to wait 15 minutes for every other pomegranate or did I say pomegranate? I meant dragon fruit. Let's get this started. Beautiful. So here I've got a little bit of food there. Oh, and that's right here. I set some 30 minute food. So I'm just going to reset this to 30 seconds. I'm just adapting as the day goes here. We're going to put that 30 second food. You know how it's done and keep it going. Beautiful. So there we've got that. And then one last one. Fabulous, darling. Awesome. So here we're going to go regrow all. And next, let's start feeding those dragons. Yeah. So here, which dragon do I want to start feeding first? Uh, we fed most of the legendary dragons. This one's only level three, so let's go for that. And we're looking for those beetles. One, beautiful, two, three, awesome, four, five, six, seven, and we've got seven, I believe. Seven, we can get a total of, what was it, nine? Here, I'm just going to go check. Yeah, we've got seven. So I'm looking for two more of those beetles. Here, I'm actually going to go back to the dragons. I guess I should collect that food, but no biggie. We're not in a rush for this. Here, we're going to go to the sarcophagus dragon, and we're looking for two more of the beetles. We've got one and two yes perfect yas queen so there we're gonna have that countdown start right now and next we're looking for those dragon fruit let's go here we're gonna go and refresh that i believe we got two dragon fruits Ooh, four okay hey we're at four out of ten for the dragon fruit we're looking to get to eight out of ten and then we're gonna have to wait so here for feeding dragons, we're waiting on that right now. And uh, I think it was 30 minutes in total that we have to wait. So next time I reset my food, I'm gonna do one food. I'm gonna make it uh, the 30 minute food. So that way I kind of have a timer set, air quotes, for when we're gonna be able to feed the dragons to get those last three beetles. Here, let's do it. We're going to the 30 minute food, fabulous. And now back to getting those pomegranates. I mean, dragon fruit. You know what I mean. So here, we're going to keep this going. Yas Queen looking good. We got a couple dragon fruit there. We're at 6 out of 10. And we're looking to get two more dragon fruit. And then, as mentioned, we're going to have to wait 30 minutes. So here, this is looking good. Perfect time to collect a little bit of gold. Oh, yeah. Fabulous, darling. And we're just waiting on that food real quick. 
here not quite ready yet but it's moving along just a little bit of gold down here i'll take it i'll take it oh yeah and da, 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 get a little bit of gold there and our food's ready beautiful so here we got that i think we only got one of the dragon fruit Ah, we're at 7 out of 10. Okay, so we need one more dragon fruit and then we're good to go. Here, as we saw earlier, sometimes... Oh yeah, the greenhouse counts. Okay, perfect. So we didn't even have to redo that 30 second food. Now, I'm going to set all of my farms that are remaining at 30 minutes. And hopefully when we come back, we're going to be able to finish getting the beetles for feeding the dragons and finish collecting food. Beautiful. So it's kind of one of those relay days today. And I'm having a blast with this. I love the heroic races. And this is definitely going super well. It's only day one and the fun has just begun. Oh, yeah. So here we're going to set that 30 minute food, you know the deal, and we'll be back in 30 minutes. Yeah, I did end up setting a 24 hour food just because I want to make sure I have a lot of food for this heroic event. Beautiful. So here we're going to keep setting those all to 30 minutes and we're going to keep on rocking it. Let's do this. Yeah. 30 minute food right there. Awesome, here we're gonna go there and set that 30 minute food and it's gonna be perfect. I've got a business call I gotta do. So here, that 30 minutes is gonna be just what I need to get my work done and then to come back and crush it here in Dragon City. Ba -bum, ba -bum. Oh yeah, beautiful. So there we've got two left to regrow. So here, this is the before last one. We're gonna do 30 minute food and there's the last one. Let's go. Woo! Awesome. I'll be back in 30 minutes. See you soon. Beautiful. So now we're back. It's been about 30 minutes. Our food is ready and hopefully we're going to get ourselves some dragon fruits. Oh yeah. Let's see how many we got there. We're also going to have to feed our dragons. Ooh, we've got nine out of 10 of the dragon fruits. Okay. So here I know this isn't the funnest part, but I'm going to set the 30 second food again. Hopefully that will be quick enough to get us those dragon fruit. Oh yeah. So here we're just going to set those dragon fruit looking beautiful or set the food, 30 second food. Perfect. Yeah, there we go. Oh, and I forgot about my greenhouse. Okay, I'm going to go check out the greenhouse real quick. Maybe that can save us a couple clicks there. Big money, big money. Oh, no dragon fruit. Okay, no biggie. Here, we're going to go back, set up some more 30 second food. Beautiful. And keep that going. Let's go. So here, we're setting up that 30 second food. We, don't, we already have one that's ready. Here, I'm going to, oop, I don't want to regrow all. Uh, we're just going to keep collecting that, and I'm actually going to go feed my dragons real quick. Here, we should be able to get those last two beetles. Here, let's see what dragon we were feeding earlier. Bum, 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 bum. Ooh, I think I'm going to go with, uh, let's go with the Hebe dragon. It's only level five right now. Ooh, one beetle. Come on. Yes, there's the second beetle. Beautiful. Awesome. So here we're off to an amazing start. And yes, we got the dragon fruit. That's what I'm talking about. So here, oh. We have to get one more beetle. Okay, so I thought it was only two. Psych. Let's see. Here, we're going to go back over here, and I'm going to choose another one of those legendary dragons that we've been feeding. Um, Hebe dragon. Uh, yeah, sure, let's go. Here, we're looking for one beetle, and there it is. Perfect. I'm not even going to get that dragon to the next level. I'm just going to keep this going. Here we go, heroic race. Oh, yeah. So this is awesome. Now we're going to have to breed three dragons and there's no minimum on this. There's no wait time. We don't have to wait a bunch of time. So here I'm going to reset that food. And then here we're just going to go to the hatchery and we're going to sell those Terra dragons. Sorry, Terra. Here we go. And we're just going to breed all day. Let's go. So here we're doing this. It's going to take a little bit of time, but it's not too shabby. And I don't know. Yes, here. Perfect. Here our dragons are done breeding. It's been a little bit of time. I've been doing this throughout the day here. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to get two of the olive branches. Then once I have two out of three, I'm going to go to the breeding sanctuary there and and we're going to breed that one. It's been taking a couple hours, this one, at least eight hours. So it should count for an olive branch. And then we'll get all three. So I'm going for two olive branches with the Terra Dragons. And then the third we're going to get with the other dragon. I'm curious what it's going to be. Let's go. So here, this is, you know, kind of repetitive. But it is the quickest way to get this done, I believe. So at least to my knowledge. So here, we're just going to set that 30-minute food. Should be good here. 
and 30 minute food rock on here our terror dragon's ready so i'm gonna go sell that dragon there and well keep on repeating beautiful so this does take a little bit of time but my luck with it is pretty good and here this is gonna be the last quest of this lap so after we're gonna get to lap four wait a second okay lap four lap four node one we're gonna have to collect food so i'm actually gonna save a couple of those farms for the 30 second food so here we're gonna go ahead do that and when it comes to the farms ooh, i don't have many farms available here we're gonna grow that food there beautiful rebreed let's go honey oh yeah and that's looking fabulous so here things are moving along quite nicely here eh, not too much food there but it's gonna regenerate okay so back to hatching these terra dragons let's do this so here we're gonna sell that one we're gonna hatch that one we're gonna rebreed and basically repeat this until we get to all of branches hopefully it doesn't take too long we'll see where the wind blows let's see sometimes this can take like five to ten minutes so i'm gonna try it a couple times hopefully we'll get lucky and we'll get an olive branch in like the next 30 seconds come on yes there we go that's what i'm talking about here we're gonna rebreed okay let's go my low level i think they're level five terra dragons are crushing it and yeah that's what i'm talking about here we can regrow that food and our terra egg is ready we're just gonna sell that don't need to hatch any dragons at the moment so i'm okay with it and beautiful you know earlier in this video i was placing them on the habitats and recalling them but that takes a little bit more time so i'm just going to take the quick route right now let's do this yeah so here our terra dragon is ready we're going to go ahead and sell that and keep this going we're going to rebreed fantastic and hopefully we're going to get that second olive branch very soon fingers crossed beautiful so I guess there are a couple things we could do right now. Like here, we're just going to get that going on. Collect that. Beautiful. Get a little bit of gold. Rock on. And dragons are ready. Okay. Here, we're going to sell that Terra Dragon. Fantastic. And rebreed. There we go. So here, I'm not necessarily getting a new rare dragon or anything, but this is the best way to cruise through the heroic race. Here, uh, we've got a little bit of experience. Why not? Here, we're going to go and get those there. Clear that. I've had that there for a while, so it's going to be nice to clear it. Beautiful. And back to the Terra Egg. Let's sell that real quick. Come on. Oh, I thought we were going to get the Olive Branch that time. Uh, let's give it, whoop -a -days. let's give it one more. Here we go. I have some good feelings about that. Here, we've got a little bit of gold down there, feeling pretty strong. And there's that Terra Egg. Let's go ahead and sell that real quick. And come on, universe, give us the olive branch. Oh, it wasn't that time. Okay, no biggie. Here, we're going to rebreed. And, well, we just got to be patient, keep it going. Uh, things are looking good. Here, we can go ahead and collect that. Uh, I'm kind of tempted. I want to work on this tower here. Uh, I've been working on Ramsey Tower for a while. I've got a couple dragons that could do a decent job, but I'm not 100% sure where it's going to go. Here we need flame, sea, electric, and metal. So plasma dragon. Ooh, here we've got the George Not Found dragon. Here we've got the Neo Kira dragon. And all three of those dragons have three of the required elements. So I guess for the last dragon, we just want to get the strongest dragon that has two elements. Ooh, Envious Vampire Dragon. I think that's what I'm going to send. Okay, well, hopefully they're going to be able to pull off a victory. We'll see where the wind blows. And I'm just going to take a screenshot real quick to see if I don't win, where I can improve. So maybe leveling up the George Not Found Dragon or the Neo Kira Dragon. Let's send those dragons. Awesome. So that's going to take three hours. I'm glad I got that started. That's in movement. And here, let's get back to business. We're going to sell that Terra Dragon. Yes, and we got the Olive Branch. That's what I'm talking about. Here, I am going to rebreed, but I'm not too worried about it this it's going great here we're going to go ahead and collect that terra egg once it's ready and then we're going to go to the breeding sanctuary and get that new dragon let's do this so here we're going to sell that fantastic and the third olive branch is in the house yes and here we got the celtic dragon Ooh, that's going to take 16 hours Ooh, i don't have any space left here we might have to do something about that we'll see where the wind blows perfect so here we need to get whoa hello we just reached lap four and we get those rewards big money big money i'll take it we got a gem and an ultimate sword fragment yas queen love it 
So now we've got to uh, we've got to collect 21 of the pomegranates. I probably shouldn't have set that 30 minute food there because now I've only got four farms to work with. Whoops. Okay. Not the end of the world, but I think I'm going to go watch a couple ads and speed up these berry bushels so we have more farms to get the food from. Uh, I'll be right back. Awesome. So here we've got a couple dragon fruit that we got. We're at 6 out of 21, and we're working on getting the food. I watched a couple of uh, videos to fast forward those food times, and I've set them all to 30 seconds. So here we're going to be trying to get some more of those dragon fruit. Right, right now we're at 9 out of 21, so we're doing pretty good. And I've actually managed to get third place here so I'm starting to get some momentum slowly but surely you know it's a it's a not a sprint it's a marathon you got to take it one day at a time one hour at a time and just do your best to keep making progress so here we're gonna be collecting that food should go pretty well we're just gonna refresh the 30 second food and I'm gonna entertain you while that's going there and yeah looking good so there we got a couple a uh, couple of the dragon fruit looking fabulous I did leave here the breeding sanctuary empty. Now, when it comes to breeding quests, we will have to breed some more, but not necessarily right away. So here, I'm going to get some, um, you know, not the rarest dragons, but some rare dragons. Let's see, flame and water, maybe? Let's go choose some low-level dragons to do that there. So that way, I still have dragons breeding, but they're not taking forever either. Well, hopefully, we'll see where the wind blows. Um, here, let's go level 5 flame dragon, and then we're going to look for a level 5 sea dragon. And da, 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 let's see, there, uh, yep, level 5, perfect. So here we're going to breed those 5 hours. I'm okay with that, that's perfect. So that way, hopefully, when we have the next breeding quest, we're going to get that olive branch. We're just setting ourselves up for the long-term success. Oh yeah. So here we got a couple of the dragon fruit right there, 14 out of 21. We're two-thirds of the way there. Yeah, beautiful. So once we finish uh, this node, it's node one of lap four, then we're going to have to feed dragons. No minimum time, there's no cooldown there, but we've got four battles that are going to be waiting for us, and that's going to take a total of 60 minutes. So we're going to get this moving. Then once we get to lap four, node three, we've got four league battles to go for. So that's going to be a little tricky, and I'm glad I saved my daily spin for that. When it comes to league battles here, if we check out my battles, we already did three today. So I'm going to have to wait four hours for that to refresh. And I'm pretty sure I'm going to do my spin for the league battles. We'll see where the wind blows, but that's uh, I'm 99% sure we're going to use the spin once we get to, what is it, lap four, node three? Yeah, beautiful. Here, when it comes to the training center, right now I'm training the Natura Magmus dragon, I think. A uh, pretty good dragon, and, uh, you know, the moves could be stronger, so right now it's learning a new Terra move, Sandstorm. Looking pretty good, and our food is ready, rock on. There we go. Yes, and we got two more of the dragon fruit. Now we only need three more, we're at 19 out of 21. A hey, rock on. We've made a bunch of progress today, and I'm super stoked about how everything's going. Yeah. Here we can go ahead and get some gold. And yeah, I'll get some gold. You know, we're going to be waiting more than an hour on those battles, so we can go ahead and collect that gold. Beautiful. And here the food is almost done. Come on, baby. Give me three dragon fruit. Hopefully. Come on, big money, big money, big money. Oh, okay, kind of dry season there. Let's see, maybe over here, can we get a dragon fruit? Oh, not even, okay. So here, we still need three. And uh, what you gonna do? That, it, it, it goes that way sometimes. Here, I noticed that two of my farms here, I ended up setting a 24 hour food. And then here, I've got some food left over. I'm not too sure what it is, but it won't be ready for nine hours. So I'm short of two farms, but it's okay. I'm still st uh, stockpiling that food for later. So here, hopefully we're gonna get three dragon fruits this time. Come on, oh, we got one. Come on, give us a second. Yes, yes, yes. And, oh, we needed that third. It didn't come through, but that's okay. Here, oh, yes, it did. We got the third dragon fruit. Baby, yas queen. Let's go do that battle. Quetzel, Quetzel, dragon. Anyways, here we're going up against this dragon, and we're going to use the high Kronos dragon, still trying to rank it up. Let's go. 
Woo! Okay, so that was a strong move here. We're going to use pure energy. Come on. Woo! Beautiful victory. That's what I'm talking about. And now we're going to have to wait 15 minutes. So it's probably going to be 15 minutes, 15 minutes, and then 30 minutes for a total of an hour of wait time. While we're waiting for that, we can feed our dragons. And yeah, let's go. Here we're going to go to the dragon book. And we're just going to choose another level one dragon. Uh, which one should we do here? Ooh, coven dragon. So here we're going to go for the coven dragon. And let's try to get us some beetles. Now I'm leveling up the dragons around to level seven to ten. The higher the level, the more food it costs. So here we're just going to get it to level seven. Eh, maybe let's go level eight. Still no beetles. Okay, what's happening here? Let's see. How many of the beetles did we get? We've got three out of 14. Not too shabby. And we're just going to choose a different dragon now. Here, we're going to come over here. And uh, actually, real quick, since we're at the mastery here, I don't know if you saw my new video about the mastery. I've made two videos. There's the first one and the day two video. So here, since we're hatching dragons, I want to go ahead and claim these rewards because new quests are going to appear. Beautiful. There we got a bunch of gold. Love it. Here we're going to claim this. Come on, big money, big money. Woo! Yeah, looking good in the food department. Here, we're going to claim that for getting those rare sea dragons. Awesome. Some gold. I'll take it. I'll take it. And we also also hatch a legendary dragon as well. So we can go ahead and claim that. Big money, big money. And ooh, 34,000 food. Perfect. Just what I need. So now we can go back over here. Let's keep feeding those dragons. And da -da -da -da, scrolling on down. Okay, perfect. Here we're going to go for the spectacle dragon. So here, ooh, yeah, there are those beetles. We've got two. Looking pretty good. That should be five in total, six in total, and seven in total. Okay, things are going pretty good. Eight, nine, ten, uh, eleven, twelve. I don't remember how many we needed in total. Just going to check here. Okay, we've got eleven out of fourteen. So we want to see three more beetles. Let's go. Okay, so here we're going back to the dragons and ba 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 ba. I'm gonna go with the psychedelia dragon. Oh yeah, a little bit of peace and love in the house. Here, woo, we got one beetle. Oh yeah, we're looking for those beetles and looking for that love. Let's go. And come on there. We only need one more if I'm not mistaken. Come on, yes, there we go, we got it. Perfect. So here, I just wanted to get the dragon to level seven. Oh, and it's looking psychedelic indeed. Yas queen. Hey, peace and love. Let's go. So here we've got us, uh, you know, progress, of course. And we're going to be stuck waiting on these next the next battles. So we're going to keep this going and keep on grooving. And well, this is going to take about an hour. You know, I'm probably not going to record the next of if I'm about to wrap up this section of the video here. I'm going to go through those battles. I'm going to use the High Chronos Dragon, and then we're going to go and spin for the League battles that are going to come up on Node 3 of Lap 4. Then, after that, we're going to have to feed more dragons and collect some gold, and there are going to be cooldowns on that as well. Maybe I will end up filming it. We'll see where the wind blows, but for now, that's all. Hey, thanks again so much for watching this video. I really hope you enjoyed it. Make sure to hit that thumbs up button for the like, and if you haven't already, subscribe to my channel. Toasty Gamer Boutique. Oh yeah. See you soon. Peace.